Once upon a time, in the lush forests of ancient Luzon, there was a kingdom shrouded in the mist of the mythical Mount Makiling. The mountain was home to Maria, a Dewada fairy, known to the locals as Maryong Makiling. Maria possessed unparalleled beauty and power, her skin glistening like the morning dew and her eyes reflecting the depths of the forest. She was the guardian of nature, protector of all creatures, and keeper of the mountain's ancient secrets. The tale begins when Datu Ananias, the valiant leader of a nearby barangay, ventured into the heart of the forest in search of a rare healing herb to save his ailing daughter, Dayong Kalana. Ananias, with his heart as brave as his ancestors, was unaware of the enchantments that lay within Maryong Makiling's realm. As fate would have it, Maryong Makiling found Ananias lost and weary. Moved by his determination and the love for his daughter, Maria decided to help him, revealing herself in a vision of radiant light. Ananias, struck by her ethereal beauty and grace, found himself drawn to the Dewada, his heart beating in a rhythm he had never known. Maria led Ananias to the healing herb, but as they journeyed together, a forbidden love began to blossom between the mortal and the immortal. Aware of the consequences, Maria struggled with her emotions, for loving a mortal could mean losing her powers and her eternal life. The story took a dark turn when the Spanish conquistadores arrived, bringing with them chaos and destruction. Ananias, bound by his duty to protect his people, joined the fight against the invaders. Maria, torn between her love for Ananias and her duty to the mountain, faced a harrowing choice. In the end, Maria made the ultimate sacrifice. On the eve of a fierce battle, she bestowed upon Ananias a magical talisman, ensuring his victory but sealing her fate. The talisman was imbued with her essence, her love, and her powers. With her sacrifice, Maria's connection to the mortal world and her immortality were severed, but her spirit remained, forever watching over Mount Makiling and its people. Ananias, victorious but heartbroken, returned to find Maryong Makiling had vanished, leaving behind only the echoes of her love. He dedicated his life to protecting the mountain and honoring the memory of Maria, telling the tale of the Dewada who sacrificed everything for love and duty. Centuries passed, and the story of Maryong Makiling became a legend, a tale of love, sacrifice, and the eternal bond between the mortal and the divine. The mountain, shrouded in mystery and beauty, continues to stand as a testament to their love, whispering the story of the enchantment of the lost heart to those who dare to listen.